This work presents a teleoperation policy to dynamically synchronize the locomotion of a human operator and the locomotion of a bipedal robot. All the motions you see in this video are commanded in real time by the operator. They are not pre-programmed actions. To achieve this, we capture human locomotion data, including torso and feet spatial position, as well as the magnitude and location of the net ground contact force. We condense this information using a simple model for leg locomotion, the linear inverted pendulum, which is represented by the line that connects the center of mass and the center of pressure. To make the robot dynamically move in synchrony with the operator, we first capture human motion trajectory and condense this data using a, the pendulum model. The motion is fundamentally described by the translation of the center of mass and the center of pressure. Next, we scale the motion of the pendulum model to robot proportions. In this work, the machine is about one-third of human size and substantially lighter. Finally, the robot utilizes the reference from the simple model to compute contact forces for each foot and reproduce the movement of the operator. Additionally, a feedback force, shown in red, is applied to the operator to make sure that the human movement is synchronized with the motion of a much smaller and lighter robot. This force is proportional to the relative motion velocity between human and robot. When human and machine are dynamically synchronized via teleoperation, the operator commands the bipedal robot to take steps in place or even jump. These results represent a fundamental solution to combine human motor control intelligence with the physical robustness of robots.